All right, he's Northern Michigan's own caped crusader, Mark Wayne Williams, better known as Petoskey Batman. Guess what? He's right here in studio. Thanks for being here. I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you Petoskey Batman if, if you don't mind. That's fine. Right. Yeah. Okay. Now, first off, you have a whole new suit. You just got this brand new suit. Uh, yeah, yeah. So, what happened to your old suit? I know you, something. You sold it on eBay. Is that right? Um, that was the original one from the arrest back in 2011. Okay. Um, I had an upgraded version, and this is pretty much the second version of that. All right. It's pretty. So. It's pretty cool. You're, you're warm in there. Oh, very. I'm used to only wearing it at night, so. <laughs> that makes sense. All right. I, I, I posted a question on Facebook. I know a lot of you all have questions for you, okay. Petoskey Batman. First off, tell us about your mission um, as Petoskey Batman. Pretty much to bring awareness. I mean, you know, uh, I was actually introduced to the real life superhero lifestyle uh, quite um, probably about four or five years ago. What's um, the superhero lifestyle like? There's, you know, just a bunch of us. We put on these get ups, you know, and uh, all different kinds, and we go out and you know, we do neighborhood watch, crime patrol. Um, a lot of us are into homeless outreach, feeding the you know homeless, um, handing out blankets and stuff that they need. So your your message is essentially help out your neighbor. Yeah, pretty much. It's uh, you know everything's getting pretty bad. I mean, we've got stuff happening all over the place. We have meth labs busting up, especially here in northern Michigan. They seem to be on the rise and it's like you know things aren't going to get any better unless we all kind of keep an eye open and watch out for each other so watch out for each other that's a good message and uh i know a lot of people this is one of the questions i saw on facebook uh, if you're wanting to know why batman why not your own your own superhero or another superhero well you know honestly uh i've tried my own own identity and uh you know i've always been kind of inspired by batman i mean the whole message behind him is you know he took this great tragedy in his life and rather than letting that keep him down or, or define him, he kind of used that to his advantage to become something better. And uh, I kind of like that, you know, idea. And I tried my own identity for a while, and I was actually out one night doing what I was doing, and uh, I got called Batman a few times anyway. So that's right. I so just kind of went back to to what my roots were, what inspired me in the first place. So, so you you want to help out, and I know you've gotten you've gotten into some trouble with the law. Oh yeah. In the process of doing this, what's your relationship now with local police? Um, the city police. I, I don't have much interaction with the state or the county. Okay. Um, but I see the city police quite a bit because I'm usually within the city limits and I have a great relationship with them, you know. Um, if uh, they need help, you know, keeping their eyes out or whatever, there have been a few times they've asked me to keep my eyes open and if I see something, I call and report it, so. Okay, that's good to hear though because I know it was a little rough for a while. But, oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, you have a brand new YouTube channel. What, 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 do you, what do you want to get, what's your message to everyone with this YouTube channel? Um, basically, the YouTube channel is just another way to reach people and to uh, get my message out there. There's a lot more you can convey, you know, with a video and actually being able to speak instead of just writing or typing on the, uh, the internet there. So I'm hoping uh, I'll also be able to bring light to subjects that I'm working on or looking into. Okay, so one more question here. You want to help out your neighbor, you want to do all this, so why dress as Batman then? Um, it brings attention, honestly. I mean, you know, if I was just, uh, if I was doing it in plain clothes or even if I became a police officer EMT, you know, I'd just be another police officer EMT. But by doing it this way, it brings all the attention. And like I said, it's, it helps to bring attention to what I'm, I'm trying to do and the message I'm trying to get out. All right, well, I think regardless, what everyone says, some people, they, lo they hate you, they love to hate you. Either yeah. way, your message is clear. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right.